Ah, mortal. Let me tell you of my recent visit to an Argonian catgirl maid cafe, a truly divine experience. As I entered the establishment, I was greeted by a bevy of exquisite Argonian beauties, each one more alluring than the last. Their tails swayed like the waves of the Sea of Ghosts, and their scales glimmered like the stars in Aetherius. Despite my distaste for filthy outlanders and Argonians, I could not help but be drawn to the sheer magnificence of these creatures. They were like the Slodes of Thras, alien and mysterious, but with a certain charm that was impossible to resist. As I sat down at a table, one of the maidens approached me with a tray of sweetmeats, her eyes flashing with a mischievous glint. Greetings, kind sir, she said with a sultry purr. What can I get for you? I ordered a cup of hist sap, hoping to cleanse my palate of the impurities of the outside world. But as I sipped the sweet nectar, I found myself becoming more and more enraptured by the charms of these Argonian cat girls. They danced and sang, their voices like the music of the spheres, and I could not help but feel a stirring in my loins. It was as if the very essence of Lorcan himself had entered my soul, and I was consumed by a desire that I had never known before. And yet, despite my lustful urges, I maintained my composure. For I am Dagoth Ur, the immortal god-king, and I cannot allow myself to be swayed by such base desires. But still, I cannot help but yearn for the touch of those scaly, cat-like creatures, and I know that one day I will return to that Argonian cat-girl-made cafe and experience once again the divine pleasures that it has to offer.